Thanks for this question, Neverdull. The Oxford inflator is a saturation tool, and it kind of works like a tape emulator in the sense that you can drive the signal into the plugin with this input fader here. And then you can back it off with this output fader. In this middle section, we can push the effect of the plugin. And this curve fader gives us some control over the tonality. So down is going to be a darker, more subtle saturation. And up is going to be a crispier, louder, more noticeable saturation sound. And this yellow split band button means that the plugin is working in multiband mode, which means it's going to process the high and the low frequencies separately. So this is a good button to push when you've got the plugin over the whole mix like we do here. Typically, I love to use this plugin on buses, particularly on the drum bus. It tends to sound really good. It also works really nicely over the whole mix for some tube-like warmth and sonic glue. Let's make sure we're not clipping the input or the output. Pretty huge difference. Still clipping the output a little bit. Have to dial that in, but that's the Oxford Inflator, baby. <laughs>